going to be talking about is doing a few different kinds of things with text. Now we've put a stroke around it. We could have changed the color. We saw those and we're going to go to text. So when I highlight this with the T tool, you'll see, come on, sometimes it goes, sometimes it doesn't. Can you see it just didn't take? So I'm going to throw that away. I'm going to throw that away. So we get the right to the wish you were here. Come on. Now I'm on the T tool. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. There we go. So when we've done that, you'll see that we've got the size. We've got all the kinds of things we normally have with text tools. We've got point size. We've got this regular. We have a couple regular bold. We've got Arial. We've got a bunch of fonts that come in with Photoshop. Anyways, but let us say that we decided we wanted another font. What we would do is we would go to... Let's go here. There we go. Come on. going to go here. We're going to go to something called 1001 free fonts. We want the free ones because we're cheap. All right. And we're going to go down here and we can pick. You can see I'm going to go for fire because I'm feeling that kind of way. So I'm going to go fire. Oh, I like crackling fire. I'm going to download it. So it's going to open up as an art as archive utility. Now, here's the situation with this. You can save them and then put them on your disk or your com on your computer so that you have them again. If you're doing them on a school computer, you need to save them as a file to your um, to your disk or whatever so that you don't you can look at them again if you want to. But I'm just going to open mine up. So you would just say save, right? But I'm and then open. But I'm going to open this up. And when I open it up, it comes up as a TTT file. There it is. And I'm going to say install font. Sometimes, see, this one came up and said it's got some problems. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to check this and say install checked. And I'm going to say, do I really want to install? I'm going to say install. Hardest part of this is remembering what you call, what it's called. So this is called crackling fire. So I'm going to go here, back to, back to uh, Photoshop. I'm going to highlight this again. I'm going to go up here. And I'm going to roll my way down to, should be here, it should, there it is, Crackling Fire. Alrighty, there it is. So now we've got this pretty much set the way we want. Usually it is good, ooh, maybe I'll put that down here. I wish you were here, yeah. Okay, love it. So now I'm going to say File, Save. I'm just going to save as, and I'm going to save this as Railraid 1 in my working. So if God forbid something have it, I has it, have it to work with. Okay. All right. So now we need to, let's, we'll just stop there and I'll go on to the next piece.